What's happening? Dustin here with Life in a Mustang, and today I'm bringing you another episode of This Tool is Cool. And today is going to be a little different. I'm going to show you how to use a tool, and that would be a torque wrench. Okay, right here what we have is a Matco Digital Torque Wrench. It's got a flex head right here and a 3 8 drive on this end. Powered on, lights up. Uh, right here it's in the menu mode. I don't know if you can see that, it's in the menu mode. We're gonna go ahead and press the U for unit. So this is angle mode. We're gonna go ahead down, it goes from five degrees to 360 degrees. Six, yep, five degrees to 360. I'm gonna put it on five degrees. I'm gonna put it on here. And this bolt, this will vibrate and, and light up and, and beep until I hit five degrees. One degrees, two degrees, three degrees. See it lighten up? Four degrees. And we're getting close. Five degrees. So you've seen it went green, yellow, red. We got five degrees and the torque wrench stopped. And there it is, five degrees lit up. You know you're at that angle. Now we're gonna go ahead and press this unit button. That's gonna cycle through the different options. Like I said, that was angle. Now we're on foot pounds. I'm gonna go down to, it goes from five foot pounds to 100 foot pounds. I'm gonna go down to five foot pounds. I'm gonna use unit to cycle through the units. I'm gonna use the plus and minus, the change, the increments and now that we're on five foot pounds i'm going to put it on this here tube notcher and it's got a few bolts and you can see right here five foot pounds it clicks and beeps red pretty simple like i said plus or minus it goes from five to a hundred now again we press unit and now we're in inch pounds we're going to leave it on 60 inch pounds put it on our bolt right here and we're gonna go ahead and that is 60 inch pounds, just like that. Uh, go cycle through again. This is Newton meters. We're gonna put it on seven Newton meters. We're gonna pull up on it and there you go. You see it beep. Now a digital torque wrench is the way to go in my book. This is a 3 8 drive. This torque wrench is uh, around $600. Uh, it does everything that I need, and if I need uh, another one, it would be from 100 foot-pounds and above. Like I said, this one gets, it's kind of a do-all, 3 8 drive. If you're building a motor, this is really a great torque wrench for that because it's going to hit most of those increments that you're going to be using. And that's pretty much how you use it. You hit the on button and you cycle through U for units and then you can go through and set memes and other parameters. I'm gonna have a link in the description on the video where I went over a full review and all the different functions and key features of this torque wrench. It's actually pretty simple to use a torque wrench, especially these digital ones. Like I said, there'll be a video in the description on how, how this one itself works, but mainly all torque wrenches are the same. This is how you use a digital one. Like I said, uh, the old style ones are great, the click type. This one vibrates and beeps and lights up. That's how to use a torque wrench, a digital torque wrench that is. I hope you all enjoyed. This has been Life in a Mustang with another episode of This Tool is Cool. It's time to show you a little more on how to use this thing. Check my other videos out. I'll see you all next week. Later.